what it do, all my paper chasers for life squad, all my YouTubers, Facebookers, RST drivers, CDL holders, doubles and triples, flatbedders, oversized, specialized, uh, uh, container haulers, uh, uh, cement mixers, uh, 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 porta potty haulers, uh, 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 cattle haulers, uh, car haulers. Uh, fuel haulers, soda haulers, beer haulers, uh, uh, what else, man, what am I forgetting, y'all comment down below, let me know what I'm forgetting, but, uh, if you got a CDL, man, you doing it right, we family for life, oh, yeah, reefer, dry van, yes, sir, yes, sir, uh, uh, we get ready to start on load number 23, load number 23, I'm over here at a, uh, service plaza, just crossed into Delaware, my DM told me to head over this way, and he just sent me my load information. We're going down to uh, Millsboro, Delaware, and pick up a load going over to uh, Columbia, Missouri. So uh, get ready to get this thing rolling, man. Stopped over here for a few minutes. Got my load information and everything, and we get ready to hit that road, man. Good paying load, good paying load to get me back over in the meat patch over there to Missouri, so uh, let's go get this load, man. Let's do it. Let's knock it out. If y'all ready to do it, I know I'm ready to do it. If y'all ready to do it, let's do it. Let's go. Hey, what's up, guys? We uh, got here to Mount Air Farms over here in Millsboro, uh, Delaware, dropping off the trailer here. This is where the empty trailers go. Show y'all the, uh, that's the guard shack over there on the other side of that truck there is the guard shack. When you pull in, just come all the way around and then stop at the stop sign right here and check in with the guard. Over here, over here, come on. Check in with the guard. And then uh, they'll tell you to drop your trailer here across the street from the guard shack. Sorry about the wind, guys. It's a little windy out here. Let me move to where it hell there ain't no wind. But uh, drop the empty trailers over here. And then uh, once you drop your trailer here, you're going to go through the where that bobtail is going right there. Going to go through there. And then you're going to make a left there. And then you're going to, uh, and then you're going to uh, go find your loaded trailer. And before you put your lock on, come back and stop by the car shack so they can uh, give you the paperwork. And then you can put your lock on and put your seal on and all of that. And then get on up out of here, man. So uh, we're going to do that right quick. And then uh, we'll get back with y'all when we get to the trailer. Yes, sir. What to do, all my people? We found our trailer. Uh, supposed to be running on my um, uh, 20 degrees. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Got plenty of fuel in it. Hell, it's damn near full. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's a good sign right there. Good sign. Good sign. All right. Check these tires. We're going to pull this pin. Uh all the way back in the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18th hole. Man, it slid all the way back, basically. Yeah. Yeah. We just gonna say it slid all the way to the rear. But, uh, that's the seal they put on it before they, uh, come out and put the other seal on. Lights are working. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Make sure that trailer light working. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, man. We got a bubble on our tire right there, man. That ain't no good. Man, I might have to get that changed out. But that thing gonna blow out right there, man. Damn it. 
Oh, we got a spare tire on there. So hell, probably call the uh, probably call the uh, breakdown department and have them send somebody out here to change that tire out because we ain't trying to go down the road and have a blowout because then we'll really be stuck on the side of the road. If that happens, we don't want that, man. So uh, we're gonna get that we're gonna get that tandem slid on it. I think I probably slide it up to about the six hole. And then uh, slide it up to about the six hole, and then uh, and call them for somebody to come out and fix that tire before we get up out of here, man. That'll be about the best thing to do. We ain't trying to get get stuck out nowhere. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll put it right down to six. Yes, sir. We'll put it right there in the six hole. We'll get back with y'all in a little bit. Yes, sir. Hey, what's up, guys? The trailer guy just showed up. Back there about to change that tire. It blew out about, oh, about 30 minutes ago. I was sitting there talking to the wife and heard a loud boom, boom. The tire blew out, man. Walk back here so y'all can see it right quick while he's under the trailer. Trying to air it up. Uh, McCartney's Tire Service over in... Uh, where y'all out of, bro? Where y'all out of? Oh, okay, out of Fellowsburg, uh, Maryland. And uh, he came over to put take that tire off and put the new, put the one, the spare on. And uh, man, it's crazy, but it blew out. It definitely blew out. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> man, 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 it is what it is though. Yeah, can't can't uh can't fight faith, man. Can't fight faith. You know, that's why I'm glad I didn't take off with it. Hell, that's why I'm glad I didn't take off with it. Cause as soon as that thing would have heated up, boom, you know, just by it sitting here, made it blow. I had, I didn't even do nothing. <laughs> that's crazy, man. <laughs> Later, guys. to do all my paper chases for life squad man y'all know if y'all seeing me y'all know what time it is man make sure you go down below the video pick up that merch you know what i'm saying your boy always sporting the merch i'm always sporting the merch yes sir y'all see what it is man uh we made it over here to hagerstown maryland and uh shut it down here man uh i've been up since one o'clock in the morning man uh uh uh, Eastern time, I mean, uh, Central time, or, yeah, yeah, whatever, man, 
I've been up since early this morning, man, to drop off load 22, and uh, we're on load 23 now. We made it over here to to, uh, to Hagerstown, here at the Pilot, man, and uh, got lucky and got a spot, so I said I'm going to take advantage of it and, uh, and call it a night, man. I had about uh, 36 minutes left on my clock. I was going to try to make it to a rest area a little bit farther down the road, but I didn't want to chance it and go down there and not have a spot. Then I would have to use PC to get somewhere else. So uh, I said, you know, best thing to do is just shut it down, take a 10, get up in the morning and uh, try to get over to Effingham, you know, and do it like that, man. So uh, that's the plan, you know. Uh, make it over to Effingham tomorrow and then shut down there and then finish it out Friday morning and get on over there to Columbia. Uh, uh, the guy uh, that came out and fixed it, that put the, the spare tire on, uh, we always carry a spare tire on the rim underneath our trailer. Well, he couldn't put the spare, I mean, well, he couldn't put the the blown one under there with the rim on it. So, had him take the tire off the rim and then put the rim back under the trailer. Everything good to go, man. We, you know, we made it over here and uh, gonna shut it down here. Uh, just wanna say thanks to you guys for the shout out, for the, for the shout outs, the comments, subscriptions, everything, man. You know, y'all checking out the merch shop. The merch shop is hot, it's popping. Yes, uh, uh, Go get your gear, man. Go get your gear, man. You know, if if, if I'm telling y'all to go get it, why wouldn't I wear it? You know what I mean? So that wouldn't make sense, man. You know, so y'all go check it out, man. Uh, want to get off into these shout outs. So your boy call it a night, man. I'm a little tired. Been a long day. And uh, I could have been here a couple hours ago or whatever and got some rest. But it is what it is, man. You can't cry with spoiled milk and uh the tires fixed and everything's good to go man so we're moving this load we're gonna keep on moving this load and we're gonna keep on moving forward man yes sir yes sir uh first up is gonna be cherry b positive vibes i appreciate you home girl uh denise denise uh games i appreciate you homie yes sir randall frame i appreciate you homie yes sir uh, Movers Life, I appreciate you, dog. Jacqueline G, I appreciate you. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Steven Reinhardt, I appreciate you, homeboy. Yes, sir. Carl Floyd, I appreciate you, man. Definitely up in here. Randy Epperson, I appreciate you, homie. No doubt, no doubt. The world is amazing. Yes, sir, I appreciate that. No doubt, no doubt. Uh... Louisa Marielle Mung, Mungi, I appreciate you, homegirl. Yes, sir, showing love. Uh, let me see here. Uh, Jawana, Jawana Nils. Yeah, I appreciate you, no doubt, no doubt. James Jasper, 1013. I appreciate you, homeboy. Rifles, 75. I appreciate you. Greg Bush, I appreciate you, my boy. Yes, sir. Sir G, I appreciate you. My man Torius, my man Torius D, go check him out on YouTube. T-O-R-Y-A-S-D. Y'all go check him out on YouTube, man. Uh, uh, let me see here. Marie Hunter, I appreciate you, no doubt. Uh... Sean White, I appreciate you. Uh, Jamon, Jamon, uh, yeah, Jamon Emerson, I appreciate you. 25 Cube, I appreciate you. Charlene Gatlin, I appreciate you, home girl. Brian Richardson, I appreciate you, my man. Raymond Seals, I appreciate you, homie. Elvin Bell. I appreciate you. Uh, James Edwards, I appreciate you. And last but not least, 
send a shout out to my brother DC. You definitely up in here, DC. Much love to you, bro. Hope everything going all right, my man. Keep doing your thing, my brother. Holla at your boy, man. We're gonna get up out of here, get some rest, and then we're gonna get up out of here and make it to Effingham tomorrow, man. Y'all know how I do, man. Y'all know what it is. Holla at your boy, man. Uh, much love to you guys. Much respect to you guys. Uh, stay dry out there. There's a lot of bad weather going on in the country, man. And uh, y'all stay, y'all stay safe out there, man. Uh, remember to use your brain, do your thing, man. You gotta get back home to your family or get back home to your loved ones and all of that stuff, man. Or get back to, you know, what you do in life as a single person. You know what I mean? You gotta get back to it, man. So be safe out here. We will holler at y'all on the next version of the shout out, and y'all be in, and y'all be safe. God bless y'all. Uh.
do all my paper chases for life squad. We made it over here to Effingham yesterday, man. Uh, like about, uh, about four o'clock. And uh, just started my pre trip, man. Out here checking lights. I checked my oil and everything, letting the truck warm up. We're at the pilot here at exit 162. No matter if you're going, uh, if you're going west on 70 or if you're going east on 70, we're over here at the pilot, man. Exit 162 over here in Effingham, Illinois. Yes, sir. I said I'd make it. I made it, man. No doubt. Supposed to be running at 20. Yes, sir, running at 20 degrees, man. Chopped off the reefer yesterday, but it's, it's constantly running, so now we're at three fourths of a tank. At three fourths of a tank on that, man. Out here checking the lights and everything before we get up out of here and uh, making sure everything working with the lights, man. But we finna do a little night ride, and it's two o'clock in the morning, 208, 207, something like that in the morning, man. So we out here. Getting ready to get on down the road, me and Miss Bailey. Just walked her a little while ago. She good to go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. About to do it to it, man. Go and load this load and uh, be moving on. Yeah, the other day, like I said, uh, yesterday or whatever, he put that, put that rim on there. Just put the rim back. There's the rim sitting there. Yes, sir. It's good to go. Don't have a tire on it. He couldn't put it back in there with the tire on it. He couldn't do it. So just gonna take the tire off the rim, the bust the tire off the rim, and uh, and put that back. Just put the rim back because the rims cost a lot of money, man. And the company didn't want to let him keep that rim. So uh, we're taking that rim with us. Got to make sure my bumper, my bumper ain't gonna fall down while we're rolling. Gotta make sure of that, man. Make sure your bumper don't come down while you're rolling. Your bumper guard. And uh, we're gonna get up out of here, man. And uh, we'll see y'all when we get over there to, to uh, Columbia, Missouri, man. When we get over there and drop off this load. Y'all be safe. Enjoy your Friday. God bless you all, man. We'll see y'all in a little while. Come join that winning team. Yes, sir. It's a winning team if I'm part of it. Ain't no doubt. Yes, sir. What up, my people? We made it over here to the Kraft, uh, Kraft Foods over here, Kraft Heinz over here in Columbia, Missouri. That's the building there. Uh, parked out here on the street. Gotta park out here until they call you, uh, till receiving calls you. The 
to let you know when to come in and stuff like that. There's some other trucks out here. This is Will. Some more trucks back there. There's a couple of prime trucks here. Uh, just waiting on them to call us. I went in and checked in with the guard already. And uh, where that sign is right there is where you're going to turn in. Yes, sir, that sign right there is where you're going to turn in. And then once you go through the gate, you're going to make a, a right-hand turn, go to the end of the building, hang a left, and then wait by some yellow bars until they come out and uh, break the seal on the trailer, open up the doors, and then they'll tell me what dock to back in. And uh, we're just out here chilling. There's Knucklehead. Hey, say hi. Say hi. <laughs> Camera shot. Look. Hi. Hi. Hiya. <laughs> yeah, so uh, we just gonna wait it out, man, and uh, see what it do. And get this load unloaded, man. So we'll get back with y'all when we get a dock door. And uh, let y'all know how it's going, man. It's cold out here this morning. It's real cold. In the 20s. Y'all be safe. Yes, sir. All right, my people. All right, all right, all right. They got us back in the door, too, over here. Uh, you got to slide your tandems all the way to the rear. And then uh, put your wheel chalk. Uh, when you pull in... You go through the gate, make the tight right, and then pull up like over here. Pull up over here so you can get prepared to back in. And uh, they'll come out, check your seal, check your paperwork, break the seal. Then you can open your doors and uh, back into your dock. Uh, slide your tandems all the way to the rear. Uh, chalk your tires and uh, release the, uh, the brakes on the uh, trailer there or apply the brakes on the trailer there and they come out and they put a glad hand lock on there so you so the trailer don't move and then they said to leave the uh leave the reefer on that way uh it's cold in there it's 20 degrees in there so uh they want the reefer on to, to fully unload you and uh we'll do it from there man so we're back into the door like I said, when you come through the gate right there where that little van is parked, come through the gate, make the right, and then pull up right there, man. And then they'll come out and do everything, and you can back into your door and go from there. Uh, we're going to wait it out, get unloaded, and then uh, we'll finish it out once we're unloaded, man. Y'all be safe. Hey, what's up, guys? We are finished. We got the green light, got the paperwork back, got the glad hand back on there. And slid my tandems forward. I'm going to put them in the one, two, three, four. I'm gonna put them in the fifth hole. Got the doors closed. Trailer is clean on the inside. Had a load lock back there. Mm, that's a first, man. I usually pick up loads. Then come back here and close the doors or whatever. Or open the doors. And it don't have no... Uh, don't have no load locks in it but uh anyway guys that's gonna do it for load number 23 man uh nice little journey getting over here dealing with the rain and all that man as y'all see man it was it was ugly on that rain man but uh it was a good ride though you know i don't mind rain it's the snow i mind man don't want no snow you know hell i, I, I done seen enough snow man but uh that's gonna do it man uh appreciate you guys for sticking with me through the journey uh y'all remember to get a video a thumbs up uh comment subscribe to the channel man uh hit the notification bell for all the new videos man like i like i say i do a video for every load i do you know just in case any of you guys ever go to where i'm going or where i've been you know there's a video for it you know and uh y'all let me know what y'all want to see man let me know what y'all want to see on the videos and uh we'll try to get it going man uh the wife is not gonna be with me for a while because uh she's taking care of things at home you know uh her mom is up there in age and stuff like that and you know i'd rather my wife be at home with her mom and, and uh looking out for her mom and stuff like that than uh, be out here on the road with me and something happens with her mom and and uh can't get home in time, man, you know, so, um, 
Uh, I praise my wife for that, you know, because if my mom was still here, God rest her soul, you know, love you, mom, love you. But if my mom was here, you know, I don't think I would be on the road like I am, you know, I don't, I don't think I would be out here like that if my mom was up in age like her mom is and, and her dad is, you know, and uh, I just couldn't, couldn't bear to be out here and something happen and I not be able to get back, man. That would just eat me alive. So, you know, man, it's all about family for me. And, you know, I hope it's about family for you guys and stuff like that, you know. And if you're a single person, you know, I'm pretty sure it's people you love and, and care about and, and stuff like that. So, you know, man, that's where it, that's where it all matters at, man. That's why uh, we do what we do out here to go home and, and spend time with them and enjoy them and, and they enjoy us, man. But uh, we're going to get up out of here, man. g Dog saying love, peace, hair grease to all y'all. We will see y'all on number 24. God bless y'all, man. Have a safe day. Uh, enjoy your weekend. And uh, come join that winning team, man. Yes, sir.